What's up, guys? Welcome to our first uh, our first video on Molt Plays. I'm super excited about this. As you can see, we are on a different kind of game. And watch this, all right? So this game is called Plunder Pirates. It's not out yet. It's coming out in about a week, all right? It's made by Rovio. So you can see, uh, let's go... Let's go in here and look at some of these troops so you can see the style that it has. It totally looks like Angry Birds styling, which I love. I love how cartoony all their styling is. So I'm super stoked about this game. It's kind of a mixture between Clash and Boom Beach, but to a whole new freaking level. Like, this, here, I'm about to show you guys something that's going to blow your mind. Okay, first we're going to zoom in. All right, so we're going to zoom in on the base. Now watch this. I don't want you to have a heart attack or anything, but just watch what happens. Look at that. Look at this. The whole thing is made so well that you can zoom in on it and rotate without any skipping, any lag, anything. It looks like it is a freaking 3D model right in front of you. You can zoom all the way out. The water looks so good. Look at the fans on these gold mines over here as they rotate as I spin. It's just crazy. It's blowing my mind. Playing this game just feels good. Like looking at it and playing it and all that kind of just stuff just feels absolutely amazing. So I am in love with this game right now. I've been playing it a lot. Um, it's a lot of fun. It is a lot of fun. And there's some pretty cool stuff um, about, there's some pretty cool stuff about it that separates it from other games like it, like Clash and Samurai Siege and all these other things that are going on. So it's pretty great. I'm stoked about it. Um, let's go ahead. I'm going to show you some, I'm going to show you guys some stuff so you can either, you can go to Plunder because it's called Plunder Pirates. So you can go over on the left, you can fight a rival captain or you can explore the seas. All right. We're going to explore the seas right now. Look at these graphics. They're freaking sweet. So you can, you run into these islands uh, that either give you loot, so you get grog or you get gold. Grog is a drink that pirates are known to drink. So grog is kind of the elixir of other games, and gold is the gold of the game, obviously, which you use to buy stuff, to train troops, all this kind of stuff. So here's the map, and you explore it by doing that kind of stuff. And up in the top right, you can see uh, that it'll give you all these different arrows, so you can come to all these different things. We can come all the way down here and explore. It'll take two minutes. Uh, and for 24 seconds. All right, so why don't we actually go ahead and set sail? Um, and it's only going to take two gems, so we'll go ahead and finish that and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So it says journey complete. Yay! We got all these ex exploration points. Along the way, we found some other gem. We found two gems. So there, we paid it off. We found two gems and some gold along the way. Why is this not focusing? Focus on me. There we go. <laughs> um, and you can see, so it opens up these areas. There's nothing there. There's a little island right there. So we're going to come all the way back, and we have 20 troops right now, okay? So why don't we actually, um, why don't we actually f go over here and fight right here? So we're going to go fight on this island, and let's see how we can do. So the troops that I have right now are, um, what are their names? I've already forgotten their names. Um, but we have Buccaneers, and we have uh, these guys. Why did I forget their name? I already forgot their name. We'll, we'll look at it in just a second. But these guys are awesome. So they deal a lot of damage, but they also take a lot of damage, which is awesome. And then we got these guys as well. These are the Buccaneers, and they do some crazy stuff. When you have them selected, you can use their little power right above their name. So we're going to go ahead and use, uh, we're going to drop off three of these guys, and we're going to drop off about ten of these. They're going to go after the defense. And then we're going to drop off uh, the other two of these guys and the other six of these guys. And once they take that out, we're gonna go ahead and use their ability right here. And you can see they are just going crazy. You can see they're blinking red, and they are doing so much damage to these defenses right now. There's only one defense left. It is that cannon right there. And you can see these huge guys just completely taking it out, doing a whole bunch of damage with their big hammers. Um, you have the hall in the middle right here. All of these are grog collectors, these things, and then uh, I already destroyed all the gold ones, but so that was the pirate hall. It just got destroyed um, And you can see on the right side of the screen uh, Where it says 87% right now two stars it shows you all the grog all the gold that I've gotten So I've just gotten all the loot total destruction right there. Look at them jumping around having a good time celebration That's what they're doing. They're just having a great time because they just got 
good loot, and 11 trophies. So that's where we're at with that. Um, let's head on back home, and then I'll show you guys a little bit more about this game. Again, this game is coming out in about a week. Um, so you are definitely going to want to continue watching here to learn about it. So here we go to recruit. Uh, recruit. So we have the Buccaneer, the Gunner, the Brute is what it is. I knew it started with a B. The Brute, the Thief, and the Bomber. I haven't used the Bomber yet, so uh, we're going to train up a couple of these guys. Once you select them, we'll train up four of them. I always do five Brutes, or at least not always, but I've been doing five Brutes as of lately. You can go to their information and see that it says he has a massive hammer, and by Poseidon's beard, he's going to use it. Destroying defenses in the game, uh, in his game, and it's a game he just loves to play. He might be slow, but boy, can he soak up some damage with his special taunt. He really knows how to cause destruction. So he does a lot of damage. So you can see his damage is 11, toughness is 800 over on the right side there. We can go look at this guy right here. Um, his damage is 36 and his toughness is 150. So 36 on that guy and 11 on him. So he does about half the damage, but he's got a gnarly amount of health compared to the other guy. We got the gunner who's a ranged attack. So he can shoot over walls, shoot over anything like that, blah, blah, blah. This is the thief. So she goes after the elixir. You can see she's got her knife. She's ready to go in there, be all shisty, all shady, and just take everything out. Um, so we're going to add some, let's add a couple of Buccaneers and add a couple of Gunners as well to get in here and do some work. Speaking of Gunners, these are Gunners. I'm sponsored by them. If you want them, go to GunnerOptics.com or just Google Gunner. You can get them. They help my eyes as I watch the screen for a long period of time. And uh, you can get a discount for using the code MOLTGAMING and you get 10% off the glasses. That's just a little plug right there for these little babies that I'm wearing. But let's keep on looking around. So we go in there, we train. You can come in here and you can train them. So this is cool because there's different levels of training. So let's go in here, let's go to skills. And you can see it starts off straight across like this. And then you can choose what you want to do. So I can upgrade this right now. I actually do have enough grog. So I'm going to go ahead and train that. It's going to take four hours. Um, and then eventually you get to the master, which is boost damage caused by attacking the enemy's gun towers. So yeah. It's pretty cool because it's a tree for all of them. So you come in here, you go to train, you can look at any of them. Let's go look at the brute. Uh, we can go to skills and you can see, so he gains health points, then he gains damage, then he gains uh, boost damage caused when attacking the enemy's walls, all this kind of stuff. It's just really cool. There's so much that goes into this and it's clear that they have worked on it really, really well. The fact that I can zoom in this close and rotate around is mind-blowing to me. It looks so freaking good. Um, <laughs> so it's really, really good. I love this. Super, super stoked about the game. It's going to be a lot of fun. Here's the market we can go into. Obviously, you can get treasure. Um, you can get some resources. Here are all the buildings. I need to build a voodoo hut. What is this? I can't build it yet. Why did it do that? No, I don't want to use my gems. <laughs> so let's go back in here. Let's look at the building. So the Voodoo Hut, we go to the little info tab. Where where do you go if you want to learn magic and spells? The Voodoo Academy. Sweet. So that's going to be like our spell factory. And then, of course, we have the Guild Hall right there as well. You can go over to Defenses. We can build some more walls. Uh, I don't know where I want to put them yet, so we're not going to do that. But <clears throat> this game looks awesome. I'm super excited about it. Look how good the water looks. Look how good it looks when it rotates. I know that I'm, it seems like I'm just freaking out about this, and I am, because it looks so freaking good, the fact that you can rotate around it like this. So uh, I'm excited about it. It looks really, really good. Like I continue to say, you can come over here, you can look at the island, you can rotate all the way around this. You can zoom in. There's a little bird's nest right there. There's a ship right there. You can rotate around everything. It's a great UI. It feels really, really good. Come up here, you can see what quests you've completed or uh, what quests when you get new ones and whatnot. Um, so I've gotten a bunch of new quests from exploring. Um, there's some more new quests. So you go in there, check out your quest log. There are guilds and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys, though. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that y'all are excited about this game. I'm going to be doing a Let's Play on it. Um, it's going to be great. It's going to be great, and I am super excited about it. So leave a like down below if you like the way that this game looks, the graphics, flawless the zoom spin of it ooh, flawless looking really really good so definitely comment down below what you think about this game i'm gonna be posting a lot of this 
uh, on this channel. So yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really, really do appreciate it. You guys rock. And as always, make sure you keep calm and play on, part of my right? See you guys later.